Cristiano Ronaldo was adamant that it was a penalty kick. The referee waved his complaints away, but you can hear that the fans here at the Santiago Bernabeu not too happy with the official. Here's Casemiro. Williams. Ball played into the path well, of Marcelo, but there's too own. much on it. Let's look at that incident once more. They're not making life difficult for the keeper at all. A wide attempt. Well, Cristiano Ronaldo certainly gets there ahead of Samuel Mtiti. There is contact from the big centre-back on Ronaldo. Whether there's enough to send the Portuguese tumbling to the ground, I'm not so sure. I have to say, I think he went down rather easily. Here he is again, Cristiano Ronaldo, and once again it's Samuel Mtiti who challenges him. This time the Frenchman wins the ball and puts it out for a throw-in. It's a throw that's going to be taken by Danny Carvajal. A very effective play in possession. Turn around the corner by Modric, but it's given away and picked up by Paco Alcázar for his first touch. The ball finds its way to Suarez, but he's given possession away. It's a difficult one for him to bring under control, and it's back with Real Madrid now, and Sergio Ramos crossing into the Barca half. Marcelo picks it up on the far side. Back with Sergio Ramos now, who plays the ball long, looking for Danny Carvajal once again. This time the fullback wins the header and finds Cristiano Ronaldo, who plays it through back into Danny Carvajal, who's in space here. His cross is cleared by Ivan Rakitic. Real Madrid coming straight back at Barca, though. It's Modric on the edge of the Barca area. Into Danny Carvajal, back to Luka Modric. The Croatian's got time and space to get his cross into the box. And it's Benzema, who can't keep it in at the far post, and it's out for a goal kick. Time for these Barca players to have a bit of a breather. Almost four minutes on the clock, and they've barely had a touch of the ball so far, the Catalan side. So we see that penalty appeal once more, and every time you look at it, it looks less and less like there was enough contact to send Cristiano Ronaldo falling to the ground. There certainly was contact, but minimal. Well, what can they do for to me, stop him running at Not him? enough for a penalty kick. He's managed to lose his marker, and I'll tell you what, Here's Rakitic. Bit like he was fouled there by Casemiro. The referee once again allowing play to continue. And it's Bale over to Marcelo on the far side. He slips and the ball's put out of play by Sergio Roberto. For a Madrid throw on the far side. Gareth Bale beaten to the ball by Sergio, uh, Sergio Busquets, beg your pardon. And it's now with Andres Iniesta. The Barca players have got absolutely no time in possession. It's Lewandowski. an intense start to this game. Real Madrid getting bodies behind the ball and putting plenty of pressure on these Barca players. Here's Jordi Alba now inside uh, Andres Iniesta. Once again, he has two Real Madrid players around him. But Andres Iniesta does brilliantly well to hold on to possession. Still with Iniesta. It's a lovely turn from him. As he tries to find Jordi Alba, but Real Madrid eventually coming away with the ball. Now sending it in. Played down the line for well, Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo turns inside. No he shoots and it's a comfortable Corner save in the more. end for Ter Stegen, although the ball did bounce just in front of him. But he got his body behind the ball, the German goalkeeper. Ronaldo did well to turn back inside. He won half a yard. Got a good shot in with his left foot. But a good save from Ter Stegen. Well, what a start to this game. Barca finally managing to get their foot on the ball here. Sergio Busquets into Samuel Mtiti. Here's Andres Iniesta. Good looking sequence. Gets the ball back from Paco Alcázar. Iniesta once more. Spreads oh, play out to the left. It's Jordi Alba with a bit of a bit of space in front of him. Jordi Alba's pass was for the run of Luis Suarez. He was offside though, and it'll be a free kick for Real Madrid. Just failing to hit the target. Good effort though. 
Bayern. Here come Madrid. Well, Gareth Bale for a moment thought he got in behind the Barca defence, but the Welshman was offside and it's a free kick for Barca. Well, it's a very tight call. I'm not sure he was offside, in fact. The flag was up early, though. Sergio Roberto into Leo Messi. Messi picks out Umtiti, who crosses into the Real Madrid half, surging forward with the ball to Jordi Alba. Oh, good run, Messi. He finds now, what can he do with it? Suarez, who goes down under the challenge of Sergi Sergio Ramos. Still could be dangerous. Luis Suarez stays chip, down, holding his the chest, the pulls out for a pass of throw. If he had the chance again, I think he'd choose another option. Not even close in the end. Well, it was Casemiro who wrapped his leg around Suarez to win the ball. He did make contact with the ball. Suarez back to his feet, and the ball back with Real Madrid. It's Marcelo. Well, no more time left. We've reached the halfway mark Nacho. here at the San Mames. Into Carvajal. Well, Pedri can be so devilishly difficult to stop, and that was absolutely what we saw from him in the first half. Your take? Yes, Sergio Ramos. See with the equaliser, it could prove to be the key turning point in this contest, as they haven't been at their best today. You do feel they need to find another gear in the second half, though. Here's Benzema, looking to prod it through in towards Cristiano Ronaldo. Play spread over to the right-hand side by Andres Iniesta. Possession so with Barca, it's now Samuel Titi. Second half in prospect. Titi inside to Sergio Busquets. Here's Leo Messi crossing into the Real Madrid half. He finds Paco Alcázar. And a goal that's it! Ivan Rakitic. First play to this near side. It's Jordi no, Alba back into Leo Messi. Messi. Poor first touch from Messi, but he makes up for it and finds Sergio Busquets. Now Andres Iniesta. Iniesta thinks about a shot. Strikes it with his left foot. And it was blocked by Nacho. Well, as you can see, this is absolutely brilliant. He's such a good run with the ball, and it's a great individual goal. Brilliant for him. Iniesta down the line into Jordi Alba. It's back with Andres Iniesta, who has suffered with injuries this season. Hasn't played so as much as he or the Barca one. fans would have liked. Here. But he's back for this one, which is important. Real opportunity for Barca here tonight, the Santiago Bernabeu, as Gerard Piquet slips. Oh, he was beaten to the ball by Karim oh, Benzema. But he made up for it quickly. The Barca centre-back. Jordi Alba crosses the ball into Suarez. Suarez strikes one. And it's wide of the far post, but that's the, the first corner. opportunity we've had we so far in this game. Better. It was a good, clean strike from Luis Suarez, on. but never on Football target. Always really. dragging it wide with Keylor Navas's right-hand post. Good move from Barca, though. Had lots of space here, Luis Suarez, to get his shot away. Luis de Galaveta. So two opportunities so far in this game. A Cristiano Ronaldo Back left-footed strike straight here. at Ter Stegen. Can they produce? And a shot from outside Just of the area from Luis Suarez, which whistled wide of Kayla Navas' right-hand post. Ten minutes on the clock, nil-nil the score here at the Santiago Bernabeu between Real Madrid and Football Club Barcelona. But it's been an intense start to this Clasico. Ivan Rakitic does really well here, Ivan Rakitic, to hold on to possession and finds Ter Stegen. Barca building from the back. It's That's a good looking Titi pass. into Jordi Alba. Well, so Alba close. back to Titi. Got a shot from Gareth Bale. Yeah, really good a bit of afters between Gareth Bale and Jordi Alba. 
Here's Messi. Great skill from Leo Messi to get away from Casemiro, and that should be a yellow card. It's a really poor challenge from Casemiro. To be fair to the Real Madrid midfielder, he went over to Leo Messi immediately, helping the Argentine to his feet, and I'm sure apologising. Just got completely done here. The Brazilian by Leo Messi. Barcelona who went one way, possession. did the other. And it was pure frustration from Casemiro as he hacked down Leo Messi, conceding the free kick and picking up the first yellow card of the game, deservedly so. 12 minutes on the clock, Casemiro already in the referee's book. That, of course, one of a number of controversial decisions. Support back pass from Gareth Bale. It was almost snapped up by Jordi Alba. Here's Paco Alcázar. His cross is a well, poor one and it's no, out for a goal tighter. kick. Well, I was saying that was I'm keeping it down. one of many controversial decisions in that Champions League tie between Real Madrid and Bayern Munich. Casemiro, according to many pundits and football fans around the world, should have picked up a second yellow card. And actually should potentially have been sent off before Ar Arturo Vidal was shown a second yellow card. Many believing that Casemiro was pretty lucky to stay on the field and play. Well, he's already got a yellow card in this game. Have to play almost 80 minutes, knowing that he can't be booked again. Luka Modric in possession for Real Madrid on the halfway line. Plays a long ball over the top, looking for Gareth Bale, who wins a header. Bale offside. Free kick goes past his way. Christensen. Danny Olmo with it. Real chance. Here's Test Tech. A powerful effort, but just wide. Gerard Piquet receiving whistles from the Santiago Bernabeu. Jordi Alba well, Barcelona goes inside to well, uh, Luis Suarez, who leaves it for Paco Alcázar. Now it's Leo Messi unless they are clinically in front of goal. to Sergio Busquets. Picked up on this near side. By Andres Iniesta. Well, and Titi. Inside to Busquets. In it goes. That's Suarez. The cause. Well, the greatest pass, but it's to keep up concentration by Sergio high. Roberto. Oh, Sergio Busquets. Well, Barca now doing what they do best, well, holding on to possession. This is a really good goal. Frustrating Just the Real Madrid players and the fans here inside the Santiago Bernabeu. The 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 played long. There's no stopping that. Looking for Paco Alcázar, who made a run in behind the Real Madrid defence. It was too much on the pass, though. And it goes all the way through to Kayla Navas. Underway again with the score at 3-1. And Titi finds Ter Stegen. Nice-looking move, this. Who gets into PK? Back to Gerard Piquet. Well, you've got to classify that as a poor the attempt. Whistles from a long way wide. The fans here at the Santiago Bernabeu. The ball with the German goalkeeper, Marc-André Ter Stegen. It's flicked on by Suarez, but he can't pick out Jordi Alba, and it's a throw-in for Real Madrid. Luis Enrique looking for back-to-back -back wins here at the Santiago Bernabeu against Real Madrid. His side last season picked up that incredible 4-0 win. It was when Rafa Benitez was oh, still in run, charge. Base. Now what can he do with it? And the shot, and the keeper diving to thwart him. The ball almost getting through to Karim Benzema. Gerard Piquet did well at the back, just to scramble it away. And now it's Andres Iniesta into Umtiti. Jordi Alba, good football this from Barca. 
Brought forward by Busquets into Leo Messi. Delivering it. Leo Messi with a nice turn in the centre circle. Still with Leo Messi. Leo Superbly Messi tries to tee up Ivan Rakitic. It's just too much on the pass. It was a couple of yards in front of the Croatian and he was beaten to it by Kalon Navas. Great run from Leo Marcos. Messi, who picked up the ball just inside his own half and ran all the way to well, the edge of the 18-yard box. Here's Suarez. And this is to get the ball out wide to Sergio Roberto. His cross picked up by Casemiro. Now it's Karim Benzema. He finds Cristiano Ronaldo, the flag's up though. Intense really good defensive work from Gerard Piquet and Samuel Titi, who just stepped up at the perfect moment to play Cristiano Ronaldo offside. Running with the ball As we see a replay now of that Leo Messi run. Well, it was a brilliant run and almost a perfect pass. Really good defending by Gerard Piquet. Very, very intelligent, knew exactly where Cristiano Ronaldo was. Step forward at the perfect time. Forward comes Modric with the ball. And he tees up Karim Benzema, who strikes one early. It's a comfortable accuracy. save yet again for Ter Stegen. The Frenchman the didn't get a lot behind it, in fairness. It was on its way in. Well, it's end-to-end -end stuff. Here's Paco Alcázar inside to Luis Suarez, who took the ball first time. It was a sort of half volley on the Luis edge of the area. Herrera has it. But he sprayed the ball well wide of the target. It was an excellent first touch from Paco Alcázar, who now Ruiz certainly is growing in confidence in recent weeks. Nico Williams. He'll be delighted that it's him who Luis Enrique has turned to in the absence of That's Neymar. There were other options. Father Turan back from injury and was a favourite for some. He stood in for Neymar or another of the front three in the past. On this occasion, though, Luis Enrique deciding to go with Paco Alcázar. He's got four goals in La Liga this season so far for Football Club Barcelona. Paco Alcázar. Wouldn't he love to add to that tally to here at the Santiago the Bernabeu in what is the biggest game on the planet? Is Modric now for Real Madrid inside to Gareth Bale? Not quite sure what Bale was trying there. Cristiano Ronaldo move from Barcelona. doesn't either from his body language. He's not too impressed well, with that. It was an outside was of the boot to give cross from life. Bale, but it, and it was close. But if they're going to get back nobody. into this, they need to score from those sort of chances. Here comes Leo Messi. Personnel change at this juncture. The ball falls for Casemiro, and now it's Marcelo. Down the line into Cristiano Ronaldo, who swapped over to the Real Madrid left flank with Gareth Bale now on the right. It's Ronaldo's shot, good save from Ter Stegen, and hooked clear by Samuel Titi. Chance maybe for Barca to break now. Messi's down, and from the close up, you can see that there's definitely. A problem here for the Argentine. Useful looking position. He's You've spitting got to blood say. onto the As field the of play. He was certainly caught goal. in the face, Leo Messi. To close down the not sure if it's a nosebleed or a cut inside his mouth. But he's definitely been caught here. Well, you can see there, it was an Very elbow from Marcelo. I'm sure it wasn't intentional from the Brazilian. But he catches Look Messi right across the face. Them. I think it's probably a nosebleed. But the danger averted for now. It's pretty nasty. Marcelo, I don't think, is a sort of player who'd have done that intentionally. It always looks worse Bidley. in the slow motion. In fact, Marcelo Rapinha. is actually bleeding from the elbow. So I think try. he caught Leo Messi well, in the mouth. Just fractionally wide. Good strike. And Marcelo's Substitution also then. receiving Let's medical attention for a cut match. on his elbow. Probably from Leo Messi's teeth as he caught him in the mouth. I'm sure Messi will be able to continue. He's just receiving treatment on the sidelines at the moment, though. Barca currently with 10 men on the field of play. 
Suarez. Does well to hold up possession, but in the end, he's robbed of the ball. It's picked up by Tony Cross. Ball over the top from Cross. Taken first time by Gareth Bale. It was a really difficult Danny Olmo attempt. The ball coming over his shoulder, tried to take Just it first time. Glide by. Made contact with the ball, but sent it comfortably into the arms of Mark andre Ter Stegen. Looks like Leo Messi is about to come back onto the field of play. Good pressure from Karim Benzema and Ter Stegen's forced to hook the ball straight into touch. Here's Gareth Bale. It's a cross into the box. Really it's not a good one again, though. No end product. More well, frustration here. for Cristiano Ronaldo, who Luis eventually applauds Gareth Bale, but his body language told Media. you he wasn't particularly happy with the cross. Busquets into Andres Busquets Iniesta. Struggling to keep possession here. Iniesta back into Busquets. Really tidy football once again from Football Club Danger Barcelona as Leo Messi plays it into space for Jordi Alba. He's going to be beaten and to the ball by best forgotten, I think. Danny Carvajal, who does well to find Casemiro. Excellent composure from Danny Carvajal in defence. Here's Marcelo. He's being shadowed by Sergio Roberto. He finds Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo on the edge of the area, tries a strike from distance. He's annoyed with himself as he blasts it over the crossbar and into the stands behind. So almost at full time and the home side very much in Leo command. Messi carrying Stuart, a tissue around with him, still bleeding from the mouth. Well, they've controlled most of the game, haven't they? They're one really and did two get clattered by Marcelo. The movement's been bright. Oh, could be! Oh, you have to categorise that as a missed opportunity. Here's Leo Messi. Back into Messi. Barca being hassled and harried every time they're in possession of the ball. As it's played over the top for Paco Alcázar. Yeah, this time he gets in behind been held in the, the Real Madrid air, defence, but Danny Carvajal is back once more Misfire to win the ball back for Real Madrid. It's gone for power, but the contact was never right. It's a poor effort, really. Tony Cross. No let up, plenty now of pressure. Modric. Back into Cross. I'm putting it wide from there. A pity, really. It's the Germany international Tony Cross once again who leaves it for Marcelo. Into Karim Benzema now. A long way from goal, the Frenchman, as he picks out Modric. Handball by Modric, according to the referee. And it'll be a free kick for Barca. Well, they've won five of their last ten trips to the Santiago Bernabeu. Probably the most memorable victory in recent years was... Space. The 6-2 in Pep Guardiola's first year. Pick up Madrid. That's more robbed of the ball by Sergio right Busquets, who's really magnificent to once again in defence. Brilliant the from the midfielder to win possession back for Barca. Well, I don't Here's think Rakitic. Stuart, anyone can really quibble about what he put into the game. Well, that performance sums him up, really. You're never disappointed with what he gives you. Such a good player. 6-2 of course coming in the 2008-2009 campaign the year that Barca won the treble under Pep Guardiola it was a vital game as well because they were only four points ahead of Real Madrid in the league at that stage and a victory for Real Madrid 
would have taken them to a, within a point of Football Club Barcelona, but Madrid were absolutely destroyed despite taking the lead on that night through Gonzalo Higuain. They were beaten 6-2 by Guardiola's Barca. The first night, in fact, that Leo Messi was played in that false nine role. And what a success it proved to be. It's Real Madrid who are having more success at the moment, though, and it's the Whites at the other end. Gareth Bale tried to turn back inside. Gerard Piquet, who's just telling his teammates to calm down a little bit as the Spain international put the ball out for a corner kick. So it's 